Vigo Hopper Frog Cheers. Let's get right to it, guys, okay? Get quiet, get cozy, get relaxed for our beautiful story, okay? Here we go. Finkel Hopper, Finkel Hopper, Finkel Hopper Frog hadn't felt so happy since he was a polywog. There was going to be a picnic, oh, a fabulous old one, down beside the water into the sparkle of the sun. But Finkel began to worry, his excitement falling flat, to laugh at me or try to grab my groovy pork pie hat. Ah, oh, Ruby, it's okay. Rabbit's gone too. I guess I'll be okay. Even though I'm scared to go, I'll do it anyway. Along came Itchy Flea who howled, Hey, where did you get that hat? And the Owlerine said, Hi there, Frog. Who let you out in that? So Ruby smiled and winked, Hey, Cat, you're looking fine today. And Itchy thanks you for like the hat. The bully slunk away. Finkelhopper chucked, chuckled, Ruby, you really chased those chumps. And just with words, I'm pleased to say, instead of thumps and bumps. Well, Finkel Hopper, Finkel Hopper, Finkel Hopper Frog, let's find the hopping track, forget the yapping cat and dog. Huh. But when they reached the track, the race was just about to start, then Ruby saw a crushing sign that almost broke her heart. Sue Kangaroo was in the race, and Ruby well all know, she's bound to beat me, holy cow, that kangaroo can go. Come on, you're a rocket, Rube, my lightning-footed friend. You'll knock em cold, you'll hop so fast, you'll wild em in the end. So Ruby's heart was hopeful as the crowd so tense they stood. They hollered, go, and off she sped just like they knew she would. The crowd went bonkers, bellowed braid, and Finkel cheered, yahoo! With one last flying, smoking burst, she came in. Number two. Her tears began a raining. There, there was thunder in her face. No fair, she cried in stormy grief. I should have won that race. Oh, Ruby, Rabbit Finkel said, we know what you can do. You do your awesome flat-out best for that. I'm proud of you. Plus, you're worried just like me, but did it anyway. So when you go ahead and try, your worries never stay. Poor Sue, she won, but she feels so bad to see you all upset. Now dry your eyes, dry your tears, my dripping pal. You're getting me all wet. So Ruby thought a second and said, I think I understand. She turned, congratulations, Sue, here, let me shake your hand. Well, thanks, said Sue, the kangaroo, good sports are great to see, and you're rolling two, uh, rolling two out there, kabonging after me. Now, Ruby, says Frank, it's time to eat. I'm sniffing deviled eggs. There's hot dogs, pizza, ice cream, too. Woohoo, let's shake a leg. So off they hopped, oh, Frank, said Ruby, you really clued me in. We do our best, and that's the way. For everyone to win. Those are some wonderful stories. Okay, thanks again for listening. It's time to close your eyes, hear nothing but the seashore in your ears.